I'm gonna meet Kelsey at Mikaj because we were invited to a little event they're having. And that's a, a Mustang 5.0. This is what New York looks like during rush hour. Look at that shirt with the leather jacket. Where'd you okay. get your shirt? It's from Par Violet. I'm a little worried about my boobs showing though, so I'm keep an eye on them. Where would they come out? Just no, you can't see it. Right. The shoes are Paul Evans. The suit is not standard, but I designed it. And uh, the body is Nicaraguan. <laughs> Thanks, man. So we are at a charity event for Pride Month. Curtis Cassell worked with Makaj to reimagine some of their jackets and 100% of the proceeds are going to Trinity Church. In addition to that, um, anything bought from Makaj tonight, 10% of the proceeds go to Trinity Church. Hey, Baldo. Baldo, how are you? We did a cooperation with them. everything into one box now. And so much of what I do is celebrating like contradictory things that we have inside of us. You know, I can call myself a transcendentalist of gender. Like some days I'm masculine, some days I'm feminine. They may contradict each other, but they both exist within me and therefore they are both true. You know? So I get frustrated when people call me a genderless designer or an androgynous designer. I'm like, no, I am a gender revolutionary. I'm not the only one, but I'm happy to like start some conversation. With the boots too? Hey. I like to go, oh! A little moment. You look great! What'd you say about this? This is gonna be my winter outfit for running around Central Park, but in the jumpsuit version, which is over there. I love this jumpsuit. I don't know about the fur, that's all. I just don't know about the fur. <laughs> Now we've got these. What do you do with it? What do you do with them? You can poke somebody's eye out with it. Now I'm stuck with this. I can't put it down. What if a child picks it up? Is that the exact line from the show? No, I don't know. Roll the clip, roll the clip. Okay. What, what should I do with this thing? I think a woman will come around. Just, you can put it on a this is table. Great. Every time I get one of these, I wind up holding it the whole night, you know? What are you supposed to do with that? This is what it's come to. It's dangerous. Wood doesn't set up a metal detector. I get used to 
catch it. Right. Here, watch this. Oh, oh. Shit! I have a full inclusive underwear company, so I have make underwear with width where you need it so you can say goodbye to lip slip. So all of the gussets, which are like the little panty pockets in women's underwear, are made a little bit wider so you're not slipping out of your underwear all the time. <laughs> nice. What's the name of the brand? It's called Cherry. Cherry? Mm -hmm. And who are you? I'm Gabriella, the creator. <laughs> What'd you get? I got a bucket hat on me. Oh, at the left one? <laughs> no, I'm not. Um, because leather will get damaged with rain, so I got a nylon. Nice. Nylon handle everything. Winter, summer, fall, and I could travel to the world and wear nylon. So I got nylon. Are you using Coca Cola flavored lip gloss? Yes. How do you know? Oh my god. You pay attention to detail too, I see. You can't find it in New York, you have to go to Disney World to find this lip gloss.